Hey there guys, this is Velma Von Proven Putin, and Nick's gonna run her through paces here today while she gets to work next to a bike. So a couple things that we're looking for when we train a dog to ride next to a, or to walk next to a bike, uh, really nice, is we're looking for the dog to lag behind just a little bit, right? We don't want the dog up in the normal healing position where they'll be, you know, kind of right on your left leg. Uh, we want her to be a little bit behind, just like Velma is right now, because we want to give her plenty of room to be able to get out of the way if he makes a left-hand turn, right? We don't want to take any chances of that front wheel running over her toes or anything like that. Um, so we want her to pace alongside, very nice, but also just be a little bit further back than maybe she normally would uh, with the nice healing that we're looking for. Um, so, you know, that's that's really a big important part. So you can see Velma's doing really well with that, you know, keeping back. If she goes a little bit too forward, Nick's gonna fuss at her a little bit, help her out, help her figure out where she's supposed to be. Because this is a training drill that we're doing here. You know, we're working on this with her. She hasn't had a ton of practice. She's had some practice, but not a lot. So, you know, we're working on this, practicing, making sure she knows what to do. We're gonna also throw in a couple obstacles for her too, because she should also always be ready to work. So not only does she have to keep that positioning nice, she also has to pay attention, right? We wanna make sure she's always listening. So Nick's throwing in some different obedience cues for her. Made her do that down out of motion right there. And you can see she dropped making her jump up on top of obstacles, doing all kinds of things like that. You know, it just helps the process of her knowing, you know, what she's expected to do. Pay attention, listen to your handler, and go with it. Nice, so she's a very adaptable dog. You know, whatever situation we put her in, she's always willing and able uh, to work through it and figure out what are these people asking me to do? What is my expectation? She's a very willing dog, willing to please, willing to learn. You know, and that's what we really like about, uh, about Velma. It's a very easy, steady dog. All right, guys, we're going to wrap it up right there. So that's just a little bit of a look uh, at Velma learning to uh, heal next to a bike.